Hey everyone! Welcome back! I am back today with more My Hero Academia, you guys! It feels so good to say that. We are going to be checking out another episode OVA today. If you're joining me early today, you already know what it means. It means you are one of my awesome patrons. Thank you so much. And as always, I'm sending out those big old hugs right through that screen. And if not, still thank you for joining me today. I'm glad you're here. I do hope you'll consider supporting me that way. The link to my Patreon is going to be in the description down below. So last episode we had um, our plot kind of laid out for us. And basically we have this survival training mission um, turned actual survival. <laughs> um, I At first I was like, I was kind of with them. I'm like, okay, um the collapse and everything, all the debris, I'm like, that's got to be part of of the mission, right? Like, kind of seems like something they would do where, like, they throw in, oh, okay, it's not just a simple search and rescue. We're going to throw this in on top of it. But now it seems like it's getting a little bit more serious. I'm like, okay, I'm not sure how much of this is actually planned, but whether or not it was, it's getting pretty dangerous because we already have Ida Hurt, which I, you know I will not tolerate Ida Hurt under any circumstances, training or otherwise. Um, so now we have to get him out of there safely, um, navigate around all of these obstacles and weird things that are happening, um, as well as, you know, try and rescue um, the, the, the rescuee, the, the dummy. Um, I found it so cool the way that everyone was working to strategize and plan out the best way to do that. And just, they're really just so aware of their quirks and how they work and how they affect the environment around them. And uh, even Bakugo, who we had like kind of charging in before, um, just seemed like he was like, whatever, I'm going to do my thing. I'm like, no, you know, we all know that Bakugo is really pretty smart. Um, he's not just like... Um, charge in and brute force and everything. So it did not surprise me at all to see that even he like had a, a, a you know, legit plan on how to do this and uh, and was not going to give up on trying to rescue the person from this, uh, from this abandoned mall. Um, so uh, it was really just nice to see everyone again. And um, <laughs> at the end though, I was like a little bit, I'm sorry, what now? Because after all that, after all they went through, we find out, um, yeah, no, that's the real fun is just beginning now. And then we see the the water leak. So, um, so apparently we're going to add flooding to the long list of things going wrong in this situation. Um, we also, like, we had a, it was just very brief, but we had a little, like, blush moment with, uh, with, um, Uraraka and Izuku, um, uh, which I loved. Um, we had some dark shadow stuff going on. Um, dark shadow is so cool when, um, and also has this like very dangerous, like, oh my God, anything could happen kind of presence when rampaging. But then I love when he just like goes back to normal and he's like, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to rampage. <laughs> it's like, oh, how can we stay mad at you, Dark Shadow? Um, so I'm really excited to see uh, how they're going to wrap things up here. Very, very fun story. It's just so nice to see our friends again and have just a little bit of water in the desert here um, between seasons. So what do you say we go ahead, we get started, and see what's going to happen next. Episode OVA number two. Let's go. Of course. Have you met him? <laughs> my wonderful boy, my best boy. Mm. He, he like, oh, he knows all of their, <laughs> like, skill levels. Yes. <laughs> That's Bakugo for. I'm so glad we found the injured person. Bakugo. <laughs> Hmm. 
今はそうじゃねえし、訓練だし、何してやることはねえかなって思う。Well, and I get that. But on the other hand, it's not gonna be long. <laughs> you extras. Oh god, and there goes the water. Okay, awesome. Oh, she is, she's gonna be real sick when we're done here. It's Sue, not us. Oh, come on, guys. They believe in you. Oh, what a what a visual! Oh, <gasps> safe! Oh God, not safe, not safe, not safe! Die to the max! Die as much as you possibly can! He must like instantly know it's Bakugo. <laughs> Blowing stuff up! It's Bakugo. <laughs> they know. They know it's Bakugo. Oh no! Oh no. We could really use Minata and his little headballs right now to plug those all up. Oh. So, it, yeah, they, it was in their estimation at least. Oh. Oh. Going back in, see if it fits. Maybe just a little bit. What? Okay, so he must have some kind of backup. There we go. Yeah. Be a good dark shadow. Don't you be a bad dark shadow. Ah! Yes. That's Bakugo for. Thank you for showing up to save us. Let's sponge off him as much as we can. <laughs> We're about to find out. Oh my lord. This is really getting dangerous. I'm actually kind of like a little bit surprised that this is all kind of part of the plan, or at least it was something that they knew could go wrong. Go get him! Oh, she's, oh, she's making as much as she can. She's, oh, she's really straining my girl. Oh, they're so good to each other. Plus Ultra, you guys. Sure, that's why. Oh, yeah. That's a good point. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. They're all, like, on the same page so much. They're going to be great heroes. I'm so proud of them. Uh, <laughs> the little chibi. Oh, they're okay. Uh, he's so on board. Mm. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Get hurry, baby. I'm so glad to see you, friend. That's what he meant to say. You just gotta know how to speak Bakugo. That's all. Oh, this is gonna be good. There we go. That's exactly what we wanted. 
Okay, now we're doing the ice. And now we're doing the explosions. Oh no, oh God! Oh! Get him, get him, get him. It wasn't enough. Oh! Oh! oh my Lord, there's too many people falling in this one. Oh, yeah, be careful, honey. Don't get up too fast. We're missing a few, but they're on their way. They're all going to go back, aren't they? They are going back in, okay. Mm -hmm. Look at look at this proud papa! He's like, my children, you are doing so well. Where is Kachan? Oh no! Oh my, oh my lord, his leg. I don't know if they're gonna be able to heal that with a kiss. <laughs> I'm fine, friend. Thank you for your concern. He's such a tsundere. Come on now. He's, you know what? He's very um, independent. Let's see how they're all helping each other, though. That's what being here is about, too. He's going to fight you on this, Bakugo. Sure. Yeah. You can't tsundere your way out of this one, Bakugo. <laughs> He's technically doing it himself. If he has a Oh. Okay. We're we're going method with the with the roll of the cane. Oh boy. It's like you're a cane now. You you just do cane things. Aww. Aww. Plus ultra, my friends. Oh, look, he's he's still like, stop your cane, don't talk. Aww. Yes, I loved it. All right, you guys, let's talk. That was so good. I love how they all work together and help each other. And it's it's never about who's saving who. It's just they all save each other. They all work together. And I just love it. I love that they know each other so well now that like, especially and especially Yuzuku, because his, the way that his mind works is so like this. Um, but I love that... Um, you know, we saw him putting together the whole thing. Kachan did this. This is how he would do that. If he does this, this is going to happen. Like, he, um, he most of all just has that intense ability to strategize. But they all do have it to a degree. They've all learned how to plan and strategize and think in these situations and use their quirks and how not to use their quirks, how to... Um, you know, kind of the physics of, of all of it. Um, it was so nice to see uh, everyone get out to the other side and then be like, all right, we're going back in for our fellow heroes. Um, I knew they would, or I knew they would at least do something, you know. Um, so it was and wasn't kind of part of the, the, the strategy or part of the um, um, survival training. Um, it kind of sounded like it was always possibility that the collapse could happen, that the flooding could happen. And like, they kind of knew and they, they like, they weren't gonna let anyone die basically. Um, but then again, I mean, 
I can't say I blame them for putting these kinds of situations in front of our kids as unfair maybe as it may seem at first or like, wow, that's like that could they could really be hurt, but they could really be hurt um, as heroes as well, you know. Um, so they have to and this is still like a somewhat controlled environment because he even said he's like, I've made provisions in case anything. So I imagine there was like a backup team or there was something that was, you know, he he had some kind of uh, plan if it looked like anyone was, like, for real going to die or not make it out. Um, but, I mean, better that they that they have those kinds of situations in a controlled environment, I guess, somewhat controlled environment, um, than just be out there and be like, okay, we got our licenses now. Oh, my God, an avalanche. <laughs> what do I do? Um, so, and it's, I mean, it's pretty cool to watch because after all this, after all they've been through in the season, you're sitting there thinking like, what could they possibly put them through that they like would not be able to deal with? But I mean, every situation is going to bring its own unique challenges. And so, um, I thought that was a very cleverly done rescue mission, um, so proud of our kids for how they handled themselves and um i think aizawa was also very proud i um am just enjoying the heck out of bakugo just watching him in action is such a delight and just like translating for him because you know like we know him well enough now to know that underneath that like tough exterior he is tough but we know kind of like what motivates him and what drives him and everything. And we know like deep down he has this really good heart and uh, and wants to do well and work well with with uh, the other heroes and everything. So um, and ultimately be, you know, number one. So um, I'd say he's doing pretty well. He's well on his way. Um, he needed a cane there for just a little bit, but that's OK. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> that was so cute. What a great way to end it. I just absolutely loved it. So, you guys, this was like a, a cool breeze in hell when it comes to <laughs> waiting on all these anime to start back up again. I don't know when season five is coming, but I cannot wait. And I'm so glad that they released these fun little episodes for us to enjoy and have to uh, appreciate and cherish uh, while we wait for the new season. So, um, I hope you enjoyed watching along with me. I had a blast. Thank you so much for joining me today. Please be sure to join me next time and we will watch it together. Bye for now guys.